Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and the Paramotor to PB series. This for me, it's a culmination flight. I think I'm ready. So Jim basically gives me the aircraft, allows me to do all the pre-flight checks, all the taxi out, all the radio calls, and lets me go out of circuit. And then he starts throwing more emergencies at me. So anyway, let's leave the flight briefing room and I'll join you at the airfield. Today, obviously, you know, we're pretty happy with your flying, so everything's yeah. everything's good and pretty much done. We just want to do a couple of engine outs, you know, in, out in the real world rather than around the circuit. Yeah. Uh, and uh, anything else you want to cover, we can we can look at, and then we'll just come back and rejoin the circuit. Yep. So um, today, uh, you know, I'm just going to really sit in the back and let you do all the all the work. Really, I'll just shut up and let go. Okay. Okay. Right. Green takeoff checks. Controls column three. Knees clear. I'm very conscious of your knees. Well, thank you. Golf by Alpha lining up T2. All yours? Okay, all mine. Uh, into wind, no, in the wind. Uh, steering straight. Golf by Alpha taking off T2. Neutral, full power, keeping straight, bar coming forward. Get rid of the vibration, climbing away. It's a left hand circuit today, so we'll depart from the downwind leg over to a portery. GSPs are still in the green.
where you're going to turn and where you're going to turn final. And remember, you tend to land on what you're looking at, so look at the actual yeah. bit of the field you want to land in. I'm going for that one there. Okay, one with the sheep or the whack one? The sheep one. Okay. So no, it's nice, you're in a really good position there. I'm going to cut in early. I'm going to lose some, I don't want to interfere with those trees. Yeah, we'll climb that way. Okay. There's nowhere to go here. 
it will stop on you. The, the, the engine will stop on you. Yeah. So you mustn't think it's never going to. Or it might do in the future. It's going to stop on you. It might be in the next five seconds, or it might be in the next five years, but it'll do it. Yeah. I guarantee it. I'm going to peel away to keep away from the yeah, car yeah, on the yeah. sheet. Good idea. And we'll go back towards our pottery here. Yeah. I sort of hark back to what you said. Sometimes you just don't have an option. You've got to make it what it is. But if, if during the climb out you're already thinking about uh, if you've just taken off from somewhere and there's yeah. not much in front of you, if you're thinking about it as you're climbing, mm. you're one step nearer to surviving the problem, aren't you? Yes. Because you've already got, you're already thinking, oh, well, big house, I don't want to hit the big house, I don't want to land on the factory roof, and all the other things that you can dismiss. Yeah. Uh, which will leave you the, you know, somebody's back garden or whatever the, the other option is. Yeah. I'm going to all be round up my tree. Yep, and then we can think about a base joint for Tutu. Dunkerswell Radio, Golf, Charlie, India, Papa Alpha, overhead up our tree, uh, requesting rejoin information. Fire coming in, runway 22, uh, QFE 971. Runway 22, uh, QFE 971, Golf, Papa Alpha. Okay, my highest access is secure, are you secure in the back? There's something over there, I don't know what that is. Yes, seen, oh. just about coming to the cloud top. I'm going to go left. Well, we're in a pretty good position to join now, if you want to join. OK, I'll turn right, join back in. Yeah. I seem to descend a bit. I'll descend in the turn. I'll tell you what, we'll just orbit round to the to the right here and let him go first. Yep. Which is, I think, was what you were going to do in the first yes, place. Yes, it was. I was yeah, going to let him go through. Yeah, that's OK. Because he's faster than us. Yeah, that's fine. Yo, are you secure on the back? Yeah, I'm good. Fuel's on sufficient for any go-around as required. Uh, we've we know we're on runway 22 and I'll be aligning myself on the runway heading off a base leg. Um, we're going to clear this traffic which we've seen and I'm still looking out for other traffic. I can't see him at the minute, he's going to be behind my wing I think. Yeah, he's okay. And I'm at 900 feet, still descending. There he is, he's just on the wingtip now. I don't know if you can see him. Yep. Got him. Cool. And hopefully the speed difference should give us some separation for landing. Cold Papa Alpha joining left base, runway 22, visual one ahead. I'm slightly out of practice with my RT. Yeah, that's right. The trick is to keep it simple. Yeah. Don't be one of these people that tries to tell everything about everything and tell your life story every call. <laughs> Just keep it real simple. Yeah. Where am I? What are my intentions? And where am I going? Yeah. Seeing the one uh, coming on final now. Yeah, so you're number three. Yeah. Golf Papa Alpha turning final, visual one ahead, runway 22. And if all goes well, it'll be a touch and go. Okay. Golf Hotel here, red band with 22 left hand touch and go. Nope, 
I was more fluid. Good, we'll vacate first right. Okay, vacate first right. Bow back to the drum. Good, you're done, boy. Okay, we'll vacate as quick as we yeah. can. She's got okay. two behind you. Yep. Got my brown for vacated two two. Yeah, you are ready, as they say. Cool. I enjoyed that. So the next thing is, did you get you off in your uh, in your BB on your own? I actually fell asleep several times during that and flight, so you must be ready. <laughs> Even with my chuntering. Very good. I'll be very British and not go, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> If you've got this far in the video, you'd have realised that Jim was throwing loads of different emergencies at me, some straight after another, clearing out, climbing out from one field and then telling me to cut, cut the engine and then plan another approach into another field. It certainly did focus the mind. And as you probably heard on the radio calls, it was quite a busy day on the airfield as well, which certainly focused the mind in terms of traffic spacings and speeds. So as you can see, that last flight went okay. I was really, really happy. And in my non-British way, yes, I was really, really so excited because that for me is technically the last time I ever fly that aircraft. The next time I fly will be on my PB. And that is just so exciting, me being able to fly my own aircraft. So until next time, everybody, fly safe.